This is the Tech Podcast Network. If it's tech, it's here. You're watching CES 2014 coverage of the Tech Podcast Network. TPN.TV partners include Dropcam.com and their newest cloud-based web cameras. Visit TPN.TV slash Dropcam. All right. Next up, Polaroid. I love Polaroid. I, I remember, you know, you hear the word Polaroid, and it just brings back memories of childhood. Do you agree? Yeah. Memories it's, it's of doing this a lot. Sh shake it like a Polaroid picture. Shake right? it like a yeah. Polaroid picture. <laughs> just the uh, uh, snap, and it, you were you. Well, you were the Instagrams of back then too. That's right. That's and that's right. Uh, that's that's what's cool about it. And it just so many memories here. We've got uh, Scott Hardy, correct? Yes. And uh, and. What's going on at Polaroid? What's new? So we've got several products we're announcing at the show this week. Um, one of them is called the Socialmatic Camera. And what it's cool, what's cool about it is it's hitting on what you just talked about, which is it's basically an instant digital camera which has a 14 megapixel sensor inside with a 2 megapixel rear-facing camera, <laughs> four and a half inch touch screen, and it allows you to actually take digital pictures. And then via Wi-Fi, you can, of course, share those pictures. It, has, it runs Android. But then it also has a built-in Zinc 2x3 printer, so you can print mm. a wallet-sized photograph in the mm. moment that's geotagged and everything. Wow. So you have kind of this bridge from you know, the classic Polaroid to you know, the modern-day new Polaroid. That, that, is, that is awesome. Is it one of the products here? Or? Uh, I don't have that one on display, but I have the current product that's available in the market. This is called the Z2300. Okay, well, we'll get it up on the product I'll, shot here. I'll let you here. do that, yep. Um, we'll get it up on the product shot here. So the Z2300 is basically, it's a 10 megapixel camera that prints the two inch by three inch color photographs that uh, Chris, I just described. Chris, can we get it up on the product shot here? Thank you. We'll get so yeah, so, so basically it allows you to print um, these two inch by three inch photographs directly from it. It's capturing a digital image and then you can print and share in the moment. You know, we, we like to describe ourselves that Polaroid was the original social network. You took a picture and you shared it and social networking is all about um, people wanting to instantly share what they just captured. Okay. And so this allows you to do that both instantly and digitally. Yeah, it, it feels it, it feels big, but you know you got to remember yeah. there's there's a printer in there. There's a printer in there. That's right. That's so right. that that is awesome. And and does it have the shake technology? <laughs> <laughs> there's no need to shake in this okay. case. But you know, hey, I can bring, I can I can say, hey, kids, you know, this is what I had to yeah. deal with, and this is or not deal with. This is what I this exactly. is what I did when I was a kid. So and we actually still do sell the analog, you know, uh, camera, mm -hmm. and it basically takes wallet size photographs widely available, kids love it, top selling item in the holiday this last Q4 because they, it, to them it's magic. You take a picture and then it develops before your eyes and yeah. they loved it. Oh so yeah, anyway, so that was up there too. Okay. Being what? that your mm. uh, camera, the generation you can't bring here, yeah. that it's running Android, does that mean that it's extensible in some way? You know, it, it basically gives us that open platform element that we can continue to open up you know, the system, if you will, that if we find unique applications, unique usage models, it gives us that openness. Mm -hmm. um, initially, we're going to keep it more of a walled garden so we can at least control that experience. But I think that, that you know, all things evolve in time. Nice. Yeah. All right. The other cool product we've launched, yes. um, there's two, you know, as you guys know, one of the big growing segments of the market is this action sports segment, right? Yeah. And um, once again, it's all about being able to capture those experiences and instantly share them. And so we've got two products we, we launched. One of them is the, is the C-Cubed. And what the C-Cube is, it's basically an under $99 um, uh, 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 camera. It's a video camera. It captures 720p, full, uh, 720p high definition. has a 120 degree um, you know, viewing angle, and it's magnetic. And so it's a super cute, adorable little product that you can buy more than one so that, you, so that your kids can capture multiple angles. When they're skateboarding down the driveway, when they're you know, wakeboarding behind the boat, it's about getting different perspectives, not just the one of, you know, from, where the, from they're wearing, but you want to get it coming back at them. So maybe you mount it to the tow rope, maybe you have one mounted to the, you know, to the wakeboard itself or the skateboard or the surfboard. And so by making it affordable, Polaroid's always been about instant sharing and having products that are affordable and available to the masses that are cool and fun to use. And that's what this product opens up for us. 
Okay. Um, now the big the, the big brother of that product is this one here that we're announcing. I'll let you do the product you know shot right. of that. I'll do the Vanna White. The Vanna, okay. you want to be Vanna okay. White on Vanna that White, or yeah, turn it? Um, this is the XS 1000i. Also getting a lot of interest. This is basically a, a high end. Um, oh, spun actually, it right off of the mount. Well, I, thought, nice. I thought it was an actual spinner. I'm <laughs> and, sorry. And, and it actually, I'm breaking things here. <laughs> <laughs> no worries. Okay, okay so this is... Uh, this What's is cool a, about okay. this is it's got Wi-Fi. So, so this one, you can take your, your Android phone, um, your Apple iOS device, your smartphone, and actually through a peer-to-peer -peer Wi-Fi connection, you can view exactly what it is you are shooting. So a lot of times, if you've ever used an action sports camera before, you mount it to your ski helmet, and you don't know, am I, am I pointing up, am I pointing down? And, and so you're kind of trying to you know, yeah. manually modify it. In this yeah. case, you have Wi-Fi streaming, and so you can actually see, okay, you know, here's my shot, here's what I'm capturing in the moment, and then being able to you know, see what you're viewing, see what you're shooting. We got so many questions on these, but no, we're running right. out of time here. So let's, let's get some price points and, and uh, yeah. we'll go from there. So this camera here, the Z2300, retails for $179. Okay. The Socialmatic camera coming later this year is uh, a $299 retail. Okay. And then the XS 1000i is going to be a retail probably um, around 179 to 199, and then the the C cubed is a under 99 dollar retail. All right. Great. Where do people go for more information? More information go to polaroid.com. It's all available there. All right. Perfect. Very Thank good. You. Thank, Thank you, you, gentlemen. Very, very Thank much. You. All right. Nice meeting you. You know, if it wasn't for our sponsors, we wouldn't be doing the CES 2014 action. Dropcam is one of those sponsors. They have great prices available for cameras that you can put anywhere in your house. You know, if I had a drop cam, I could actually set it up in the living room and see what's going on. You know, with the frigid temperatures that we had last week, I could have checked it on the house, made sure that the power was still going or made sure that there wasn't any other problems, listened in if there, if I could hear something and go from there. So check it out. Go over and check out all the drop cam models. Go over to tpn.tv forward slash drop cam tpn.tv forward slash dropcam. Of course, it'll help our CES 2014 coverage. Thank you very much, Dropcam.